how things came to be. I've always been devoted to my mission. Never deterred from my goal, no matter the sacrifice. Because I've seen where this leads. I've seen where it all ends. We have a problem. No word from Jack Joyce's transport. It should have arrived here by now. We may have a traitor on the inside. You're due for your treatment. I'll find who's behind this. Find Jack. That's our priority. Get your best man on it. There's more. As you know, Jack's level of interference led to unexpected complications. Witnesses from the university were transported here. You need to take a look. We can't afford any further obstacles at this stage of the plan. Now, I see two options. We could use force, remove any loose ends. But if those witnesses disappear, the public will start clear, asking sir. questions. Potentially turn on Monarch. Mr. Alternatively, Serene. I could mount a broad PR strategy, get the city on our side. But that leaves us with the... The loose ends. Precisely. The choice is yours, but keep in mind, the men will view your decision as a unified strategy moving forward. It was the first time I'd visited the Ground Zero operation in ages. The location I'd arrived in when I went 17 years back in time. The location where my fate was sealed six years ago. We had Jack in custody, but I was starting to witness visions from the future which made it clear that could change very soon. I suggest we deal with the issue at hand. Liam Burke over there can explain the situation in more detail. Of course. <laughs> I want this delivered to my office. What is it? A reminder. Sir. Who is this? Amy Ferrero. She's one of the witnesses. Awaiting your orders on how to proceed. My powers grew stronger, even as the Cronon Syndrome worsened. I could choose a path that would become the actual future. But it wasn't optional. The moment wouldn't end until I made up my mind. Potential threats to our plan need to be erased. Wait! Monarch would take a hardline approach. Crush all obstacles, eliminate all witnesses. It would be harsh. But I had made hard choices for the greater good before. I dug through the area and I found everything I could on your bro. This is messed up, man. Trusted monarch. But the people of Riverport would turn against us. You murderer! Our secrets would be safe, but the public would hate us, and Jack would gain new allies. Monarch's got no authority to stop you, and you tell that to everybody on that bridge. Taking the hard line. Any potential threats to our plan need to be erased. Take her and the others to the Ground Zero operation. Make it quick. 
painless. No, wait. Please! There's no other way out. We're going through the machine. Oh, wait. No! Jack! This way! Jack! I use my power to guide us. To decide how to best prepare for the inevitable end of time. That gives the chosen few a chance to survive. I've seen the end of time. Let's talk about the dry dock incident. Monarch operatives transported you from the university to the ground zero operation at the shipyard. Still upset about that, huh? You were secured, unconscious. Well, uh... Liam Burke went to retrieve you, and you were gone. How? Sleepwalking. Step away, right now. You have three seconds till I pull. I have better reflexes. And you're a marksman. We know Beth Wilder assisted you in some manner. Then I'm guessing you know the rest. No, because everybody who saw what you did next is now dead. I didn't have a clue where I was or why. Never questioned it because it didn't feel real. Still waiting to wake up. Beth Wilder risked blowing her cover to rescue you. Sounds like you didn't exactly return the favor. No. I didn't. Only way forward. Weird.
Okay. Doesn't last. Noted. When the fracture broke time, some objects became... unstable. With my new abilities, I can manipulate their timelines. Rewind them. For me at the dry dock. I'm heading to the island. Roger. We'll have the chopper. Seeing Paul's face on that screen, it was some kind of sick reminder. I couldn't escape what had happened, what he did. I needed to know why, but part of me wanted to put a fucking bullet in his head before he could open his mouth. Want us to send additional teams to search for Joyce? Negative. Focus efforts on disposing of those witnesses. Clear any trace of our involvement. Jack will come to us. The island tonight. During the gala? You're sure? Positive. Dispose of the witnesses. Is this the last of the witnesses? No. Reaper team's finishing up with the last of them in A3. We didn't expect to be leaving the university with a kill list. Why not deal with Red Ryan's hit! This elevator looks like the only way out of here. There's gotta be a generator around here somewhere. No power. Figures. Okay. Looks like that elevator needs power.
Hello. Jack, this is Beth Wilder. Beth. I'm... You're the one my brother was looking for. I'm the one who was attempting to rescue your ass until you decided to go on a gun-blazing ship parade through that warehouse. Now listen closely. You were at the outskirts of a Monarch Conan harvesting operation, and Paul Serene is in dry docks nearby. Not a recipe for fun times. So how about... Dry docks. If Paul's at the dry docks, then that's where I'm... No! Jack, the fracture is our only priority now. Time is ending. Will said he... Will's dead. My best friend came back a goddamn monster. He knew this would happen. He prepared for it. But Paul's the key to understanding all this, and I'm gonna find... We both know that if you find Serene, you're not gonna be asking questions. Think this through. Paul was at the dry docks in the distance. I recognized the place. William had a workshop in that industrial area for years. I knew that couldn't be a coincidence. pin again? Yeah, I think so. Our solutions building a better future. How did you hear the taxi guy? He drove me to the university. What is all this? They're killing everybody. Everybody from the university, they grabbed me out of my goddamn cab. Jesus. You saved my ass. You motherfuckers. You I'm still figuring that out. Monarch was supposed to be the good guys. Look, I need to get to the dry docks. Do you know how to get there? Dry docks, uh, yeah, I think I know the way. Whatever you need, I got your back. Keep fighting. Those are my last words to her. Sent chills up my spine to think I might have- We're not here to talk about Amy Ferrero. We gotta make it through that building to get to the dry dock. Thank Christ you're okay. What about that guy you went to see at the campus? Did he get out all right? No. Not exactly. This is messed up, man. <clears throat> I trusted Monarch. We can't let them get away with this. <laughs> Gate's locked. There's gotta be a gate doohickey around here. I'll take a look. I can't believe this. The world's gotta know what happened here. They will. I'll make sure of it. Yeah? I'm going WikiLeaks on these assholes when we get out. First! I gotta figure out how WikiLeaks works, but then I'm gonna WikiLeak the shit out of them. Uh, oh, by the way, how did you lay out those guys back there? Had you ever fired a gun before all this? Yeah, I have. Like, at a person. 
Yeah. Uh. Damn. Not necessarily. Oh, shit. You just... What are you, some kind of goddamn X-Man? That was... Okay. Don't panic. It's, um... Freaking sick, man! All right. Not the reaction I expected. I only know what my brother told me. Time is breaking down and Monarch is involved somehow. It's really not. So what is this place? What was Monarch doing at the university? Get me to that dry dock, and I'll find out. <clears throat> Looks like there's an open window up above. It's worth a shot. Wait here, I'll try that. Man, this place gives me the creeps. Monarch bought up the whole area in 2010, but the real question is, why was everyone so eager to sell? I've heard everything around all unemployed or, or whatever oh, okay that Made last part needs some work now to get to that door yeah that's definitely a theory mr serene's chopper is inbound for hey clarice hey you this is hq alpha Charlie, i told you to stay hey the don't forget about me I'm starting to get a little antsy out there. All right, where are we going to next? Oh, hey, there's a map over here. We can figure out the best route to the dry docks. Hmm, security's tight. We might have to head through that area called Ground Zero to get there. That's the exact area where my brother used to have his workshop. Your bro. You think he's connected to this somehow? I'm gonna find out. You should stay here for now. I have a feeling the next part's gonna get messy. Yeah, I don't do messy. All right, I'll guide you to the dry docks from here on the radio. Channel three, I'll open up the door for you. Deal. Still no word on Joyce's location. Yeah, I heard his brother scream like a bitch when he died. When he shows his face, I'll make him do the same. Son of a...
They kept growing by leaps and bounds. Nick, are you there? Talk to me. Where am I going? That warehouse is split into two halves. Find the exit, take the alley to the other side, and let me know when you're there. All right. Contact! Oh, great. Shotgunner advancing on hostile! Motherfucker. Alright, taxi guy. Where am I headed? It's Nick, by the way. Jack. Okay, uh, there's a door on the upper level leading to a sky bridge, but looks like you need to turn off security to get it open. How do I do that? On the map, there's a squiggly line that leads from the door to a big square, and that square has two squigglies leading to little circles. What the fuck does that mean? What am I doing here? Locked, like he said. Gotta follow the squiggly line. Joyce just 
took out Gatehouse for us. You still don't have eyes on him? What, what do they pay you for over there? Huh? Charlie, just tell me where he is. Do I hear him, please? Charlie? Okay, security's down. Okay, security's down. Damn, uh, that was quick. On the bridge. Oh, uh, map says you're heading towards a storage facility for uh, Meyer Joyce particles and harvesting equipment. Joyce particles? This whole operation is based on my brother's research. Your bro? You don't think he's working for. No. I don't, I don't know what to think, but Paul is up to something big. Let's see if you can find out.
Nick, I'm on the bridge. Well, uh, map says you're heading towards a storage facility for, uh, Meyer joist particles and harvesting equipment. Joist particles? This whole operation is based on my brother's research. Your bro? You don't think he's working for... No. Coronal levels will lower to a point that renders Ground Zero obsolete in the near future. I'm queuing up the presentation to make sure everybody remembers the event before we proceed. Hello, I'm Dr. Sofia Amaral. Over the past six years, Monarch has made vast technological advances in the area of Joyce, HQ, target sighted, over. All units, target has been That's the last of Nick. I'm in the harvesting warehouse. It looks like there's no clear exit on the ground level. Head for the upper floors when you're ready. No clear exit down here. May have to head upward. There's gotta be something I can use to get up there. Closer, I think. It's real bad now. Now, which okay. way's the dry dock? Bobby's mad people. Okay. So we don't know exactly what went down. But that library came down way ahead of schedule. I got that I got briefcase that we lifted from William Joyce's car. Laid out the contents, out the contents in the trailer. You want me to go through? No. Serene wants the first look. Till then, hands off. Hands off. And why? Why 
Why is this happening? We don't know. Paul's men had taken the briefcase from Will's car, dumped the contents on the table. Will had said he needed something from his briefcase to stop the fracture. Wasn't much there but his phone and a key to the Bradbury swimming pool. Not the most obvious clues. Jack, it's Beth. Monarch got footage of some idiot accessing Facebook from a nearby security station. Please tell me said idiot isn't with you. Nick, I gotta go back for him. Don't. I'll pick him up. Where are you? I'm on my way to Paul at the dry docks. Serene's not the priority. I'm getting you out of there. I'll meet you at the dry docks. Channel 1 is the Monarch frequency. Use it to keep ahead of them. And Jack, don't do anything stupid. It's locked. It's got to be another way to get through here. Jesus! Close one. HQ, we just heard an explosion near the harvesting perimeter. Can't take a wild guess at that kind of bet. Charlie, get off the line. Striker team, take defensive positions around ground zero. Roger. I recognized Will's workshop as soon as I saw the old billboard on top. The area we refer to as... Yeah. 
for his men to move through stutters. He knew the fracture would occur. Prepared for it. Holy shit. And he never tried to stop it. Never told you what he did in that workshop at Ground Zero? No, never. He hid that part of his life from me. Nothing prepared me for the weirdness that was waiting there. And even that was just a prelude to the bad stuff that would follow in that same place later. Absolutely no entry. Well, I'm pretty sure that's more of a guideline than a rule. What is this? What the hell? What, hell? what, is, what this? is this? That already happened. What the fuck? Requested copper clad Niobium. There's no words to describe it. Will was gone, but he was all around me. This entire secret life he never talked about, everything he tried to protect me from, it surrounded me. Puzzle. Trapped in broken time. We all thought he wasted his research grant, his career, obsessing over some failed experiment. That's what he led us to believe. What he built there, it never failed. It works. It works. Need my, Need my grant extended, extended another year. year. Please, Please, don't do don't this. Do this. I knew something went horribly wrong there, but it was scrambled. It was impossible to crack.
It was overwhelming. Every unanswered question I had was compounded by what I'd seen at that workshop. The events at the university were part of something much bigger. Something that had started 17 years ago. Okay, dry dock. Get to the dry dock, I'm almost there. Gotta get to Paul. There was something wrong with Paul. Coronon syndrome. He'd had his powers much longer than me. What was the cause? Was I sick as well, or was it his time travel? I didn't know. It didn't make anything he'd done any less hateful. Yeah. Jack, you have to understand that Will forced my hand. What the hell happened to you? There's no use fighting. You killed him! I'll explain when the time is right. You'll meet me tonight at the Monarch Gala. Gala? Time's ending and you're having a fucking party. Because when time ends, my plan... We do this now. I'm not meeting yes, you at... Yes, you are. I've already seen it happen. Seen what? What's this all for? Goodbye, Jack. No!
The stutters were getting bad. Be shifting back and forth without warning. At the time, I didn't think it'd get much worse. But we both know it did. It's like a goddamn maze in here.
Beth had been on her way to meet me. I expected she was frozen somewhere up there, by the side of the dry dock. Shoot me. Look, I'm sorry, but I'm taking the van. That's for not listening to me back there. Ow. You want to stop time from breaking down? You need my help. And thanks, by the way, for the plus one in the back seat. I'm starting to feel like goddamn babysitter. She scares me, Jack. My ride, my music. Deal with it. I love this song. 